Hi, welcome fifth graders to Wednesday, April 15th. Um, this is your intro video for today and just trying to walk you through what some of the expectations are for uh, this Wednesday. Um, there will be a couple of Zoom opportunities uh, for us today, one again at 1030 and one at 130. You do not need to attend those meetings um, and you definitely don't need to attend both of those meetings. Um, they're just going to be basically um, connection sessions and kind of talking about where we are at and what, what things are happening and what new information we are getting as teachers. Um, so that, that's pretty much um, all those meetings are going to be about. Um, I want to thank everybody for yesterday. Uh, we had our best attendance and work completion uh, since we've been doing this. So I really do feel like our routine and our process, guys, is um, is starting to hit home. It's starting to sink in a little bit. Um, people are logging in during the times uh, that the teacher is available to ask questions. Um, yesterday, we had all but one person um, of all my classes log in before 3.30 and do the brain games. Um, almost everyone logged into the science assignment and read the articles or the notes and answered the questions about um, uh, the about those notes, excuse me. And um, so that's good. Um, the math assignment um, went well. I mean, obviously the, the scores weren't great, but that was the first day of line plots. And we will do a couple more days with line plots with the plan to do a quick quiz on Friday. Um, I did have a handful of people say, Mr. Mace, there's nothing on Think Central today. Is there supposed to be? So that's a great question. Um, a great thing that uh, you guys checked on it. I love it. You should be checking Think Central every day. You should be logging into Prodigy, hopefully, um, every day or every other day to try to answer a few questions there. Um, so those are all great things. There is a Think Central assignment that is added for both of my classes today, and that will reinforce the skill that we worked on yesterday. Um, and today, the video uh, that you'll see today will be about that same topic. I would probably go there last um, after we viewed the video again for today's lessons and after we have uh, maybe tried the exit ticket or the couple of questions that are um, in your Schoology folder. Um, I would go to Think Central after that. Um, I guess you could go before that and use that as practice because you can check your answers. Either way works for me, but just realize that there is a Think Central assignment that I would like to be done by the end of the week. Um, like I said, guys, this is all a process, and uh, I think every week gets a little easier, a little clearer for us. And uh, I'm not going to sit here and say it's easy. It's definitely not easy on us as teachers either. We miss you guys a bunch, um, and it's just it's just a different experience, but. Um, I do think there's a light at the end of the tunnel. I don't know if that leads us to coming back to school in a couple of weeks, but um, at least we we know that hopefully we'll be able to uh, get out and be a little bit more active, hopefully, uh, when the month of May hits us here. So uh, continue to work hard, continue to check those things, continue to ask questions. I can't stress that enough, guys. This is one of those situations in which uh, question asking is mandatory. I, I can't... Um, I can't read your mind in class, and I definitely can't read it um, when I am, uh, you know, miles away from you and trying to uh, determine from your answers uh, how things are going. Uh, one thing I would suggest, a lot of the assignments, guys, that we are putting on there, especially the math assignments more so than the science assignments, um, we are op offering and uh, the opportunity to retake and redo those quizzes and those assignments uh, multiple times. So if you struggle, if you do something poorly, especially on the quick quiz, guys, um, please make sure that you are going back into that quick quiz and taking it again. I believe I've enabled five different uh, opportunities to take that quick quiz um, from 8-1 uh, from last Thursday. It's the biggest reason why the folder for last week is still open. Uh, so please get in and do that if you haven't taken the quick quiz the first time. Uh, but even as important as that is, if you did poorly on the quick quiz the first time, um, I'm kind of using three as our benchmark. If you scored a three or lower, I would expect you to take that quick quiz again and try to uh, improve your score. If you scored a four or five, um, you could probably be fine with that, and you don't need to retake it again unless you want to. Um, so just be aware that that is an expectation. We, we are going to be putting that quick quiz into the uh, grade book here in a, in a day or two, and um, 
you know, those scores will definitely, it's going to go in as a test or a quiz. And that will, that will definitely impact your grade pretty heavily since we have a lot more, uh, fewer grade points uh, going into the grade book at this point, guys. So um, thanks again. Uh, hope to see you all the Zooms uh, this morning or this afternoon. And um, great job. Keep, keep moving forward. Thanks, guys.